Hello children, in this video you will get to know about latitudes, some important latitudes and the position with some interesting facts. So this is Neha here associated with Aditya Kids Education and if you are new on my channel then first subscribe my channel and hit the bell icon so that you can't miss any interesting videos. Alright, let's start. Globe in the previous videos, we have discussed about globe in detail. So let's recall it in short. So first is globe is model of the earth. The globe shows us the shape and the locations of the continents, oceans and seas in a smaller scale. It also shows the shape and location of different countries. This picture shows you what the earth actually looks like. You will notice that a needle is fixed through a globe in the tilted manner and which is called its axis. You can see a half of a globe at a one time. If you want to see the other side, you have to rotate it as I did. Okay. So next is axis is an imaginary line passing through the earth and it points north pole at 90 degree north and south pole at 90 degree south okay another imaginary line is equator the equator is the longest imaginary line on the earth and most important it is the line of latitude okay Equator divides the earth in two equal parts and that is northern hemisphere and a southern hemisphere. The equator represents the zero degree latitude. As you can see in the picture, the zero degree latitude. Okay, see in the picture the latitudes are numbered. The start from equator zero and goes up to north and south. North pole is at 90 degree north and south pole is at 90 degree south. I told you that equator divides earth into two equal half and they are northern hemisphere and southern hemisphere. The northern half of the earth is known as northern hemisphere and the southern half is known as the southern hemisphere and equator divides both this hemisphere hemisphere in equal halves okay let's have a look on both of this half in detail first we will talk about northern hemisphere the portion which is north of the equator is called northern hemisphere and the latitudes that is pallors in the northern hemisphere are marked as 10 degree north, 20 degree north, 30 degree north and so on. Now let's talk about southern hemisphere. The portion which is south of the equator is called the southern hemisphere. The latitudes or parallels in the southern hemisphere are marked 10 degree south, 20 degree south, 30 degree south, 50 degree south and so on. Okay, you can see in the picture, the area above the equator shows northern hemisphere and the area below the equator shows southern hemisphere. Now we will talk about latitudes. You know children, our earth is like a sphere. So, if we draw a line on a sphere, from the center starting from one point and ending to the same starting point then it will make circle and if you make more parallel lines then it will look like a latitude so all parallel circles from the equator up to the poles are called parallels of latitudes now latitudes Line of latitudes run from east to west direction across earth. The line of latitudes are measured in degrees 
and 1 degree latitude is equals to 111 kilometer. Now, the look have um, some important latitudes and they are Arctic circles at 66 and half degree north, Tropic of Cancer at 23 and half degree north, Equator, you all know it is at 0 degree, Tropic of Capricorn, 23 and half degree south and Antarctic Circle, 66 and half degree south. This image will clear about the lines of latitudes. Okay, recall with me. Arctic Circle at 66 and half degree north. Tropic of Cancer at 23 and half degree north. Equator which divides our earth in two equal parts and that is at 0 degree. Tropic of Capricorn is at 23 and half degree south. And Antarctic Circle is at 66 and half degree south. And you know 90 degree north pole is in northern hemisphere. And 90 degrees south pole is in southern hemisphere. Okay, now see in the picture. You can see a circle. Imagine it is our earth. That is sphere. Okay. The longest imaginary line that passes through the center of the earth is the diameter of the earth. It makes an angle of 180 degree on the center of the earth on both the sides that is 180 degree in the northern hemisphere and 180 degree in the southern hemisphere ok children you know that the latitudes are represented in degrees ok so this degree is represented by the angle made at the center of the earth now let's take an example of 23 and half degree latitude north here it makes an angle of 23 and half degree at the center of the earth now let's take an example of 90 degree north okay so here it will make an angle of 90 degree at the center so okay children i hope now you are cleared about latitudes but still this is not the end of the topic latitudes. In the next video, we will discuss about different temperature zones of the earth. Till then, stay safe and be continue with my channel. Okay, bye children.